So you want to come up to Lake Muskoka or Cottage Country and you live in the GTA. Well, you're not really welcome right now. Now part of it is the fact that there's this pandemic going on and the Ontario Medical Officer of Health is talking about the kind of dangers that you're in and also what you could bring to people by infecting them with this horrible coronavirus. And part of it is because the mayor of Bracebridge, which is not too far from where we are here in this spot on Lake Muskoka, is really, really encouraging people to not come. If you talk to people who live here, they have very, very strong views about it. Even the cottages that I look after, I look after two of them, because they're just down the road from me, and I, I'm not going to open their water for them. I'm not going to turn on their heat or do anything until May 2 for Our hospitals, if we get over, they get overwhelmed, then, then we're all at jeopardy. Everybody's at jeopardy, right? But not everybody feels that way, including this gentleman who has a cottage here. Safest place for us to be is cottage. Is yeah. it? Uh, you're protected, really. So uh, a lot of people are trying to get away from Toronto, right? If everyone's, you know, does social distancing, wears masks, and that, I, I think we should be fine. And one beacon of hope is that Weber's is open. And if Weber's is open, you know that spring is here and summer is not far away. The lesson I've learned about this COVID-19 is, yeah, we've got to be very cautious, but you know what, enough's enough now. You know, let's let's go back to reality and, and practice, you know, proper uh, control. We'll see what happens. The reality is that it is a free society. And as long as people social distance. There's no two tier of Canadians. There's not us and them, there's just us. With Ernest Jerozic in beautiful Muskoka, Joe Warmington reporting.